everyone and welcome to my Ask the Author, the Ask the Author video. I uh, asked you guys to hit me up with some questions on Facebook and Twitter and I got some interesting questions. So I'm here to answer those. It won't be very long. I know how busy we are. Let's just, let's stuff. Let's just, look, let's just do it. I am totally in my kid's room right now because my daughter has the coolest desk in the family. Christine Bernard asked if, if I was not an author, what would I be doing? Look, I'm not going to say I can sing. I'm just going to say that I wouldn't mind being a singer. Sometimes I think I should be a stripper. And then I remember I'm fat and I can't dance. So, look, there's always options. The options are becoming lim limited the older I get. But I don't know. I don't know what I'd be doing. I really don't know. Kelly Hen asked, who inspired you to follow your dreams? That would be me. And I've always loved to read, I've always loved to write, I studied English after school. I think I always would have written anyway, um, even if I wasn't writing as a profession, I would be writing as a hobby. It's very cool that my hobby and my profession kind of have a crossover. I'm inspired every day by writing that I read, create the creativity that I see in my online writers groups. Um, so I'm inspired every day by a variety of people. Benjamin Homan wants to know what is the most famous and answerable question? Yes, no, to get to the other side, 1.77245. Anyone who gets that reference, it's my hero. Benjamin, if you get that reference, you're my kind of person. Clinton Green would like to know if I'm still president of the Hanson Fan Club. Clinton, you're a dick. I am not the president of the Hanson Fan Club, okay? To be completely honest, I was always more of a Backstreet Boys fan, so I don't even know where you're getting your information, but it's wrong. Google is not reliable. Galen Cocaine, one of my favorite Facebook peeps, would like to know who is my favorite of my own characters and why. My answer is Galen, that is actually a stupid question. You can't ask me that. It's like, I can't have a favorite, I'm an author. Like, I would never choose. I would never be able to pick one of all these amazing characters that I've created and say that, oh, that's the one. I don't even understand why I'd ask a question like that. Jessica would like to know when the fifth book in the Legacy series, which was originally obviously a trilogy and has now become two separate trilogies set in the same world. So the second book in the second trilogy, um, she'd like to know when that would be out. And I'd love to give a publication date, but at this stage, um, I am working on the book. I'm actually currently finishing off another contemporary for Liz Adele, who's taken up a lot of time these days. I have started it and I've been working on it in bits and bobs, but um, I'm thinking it'll probably be an early 2018 release. So I'm sorry for the delay. Returning to the Ribbon was a big step for me. I did plot out quite a large chunk of the story, so once I really get going on it, it does come quickly. We're hoping for an early 2018 release. Another question that I get asked practically every week is when the Traveller sequel will be coming out. I'm hoping to finish up all my unfinished series in 2018. So the new Rebelland uh, series, The Return, I'm hoping to finish both of those books and the Traveller sequel by the end of 2018 so that I can put those to bed and I can have all of my series up to date because I have a new idea that I want to start working on and I have decided that I'm not allowed to dive into that story until I finish what I started. Hopefully we will have both book two and three in the new return series and the Traveller sequel out next year. If I can just get through Christmas and the chaos that is Christmas. So that is it for today. That is my Ask the Author short and sweet. Um, thanks you guys for participating. It was really cool. Thank you all for the support, for the love, for the reviews. They've, I see them coming through on Amazon and Goodreads and they really do mean the world to me. So keep doing that and I'll keep doing what I do. Okay guys, I'll see you later, bye.